Hi everybody, we're Mike and Jennifer Wedlin, and in this edition of How We Roll, we've got a question from Frank who wants to know, I saw one of your pictures on your blogs, and it looks like you guys have some screens on your road trek. So here we are, we happen to be at the uh, KOA Marco Island uh, campground in Florida, and uh, it's warm out. It's very warm out. And we need our screens. We certainly do. We've got three sets of screens, so we'll kind of show you what we have here. All right, the first screen is something that can go on the back. And it fits right in. We've got a frame to put it on. We zip it in, and we have we could have the back open if we wanted it open. If we were in the woods, I probably would go with this, but since we're in rather a populated area, we didn't put it up. There's like people behind us, so we're not going to have the screens up, but it's really nice when you're boondocking someplace and you know, there's a stream in the background or mountains and you just want to see the stars at night. We love to sleep with those windows open and we use this back screen. Just like camping in a tent. In camping a tent, out, A pop-up yeah. tent. Yeah. You We've got our screen. You're close to the great outdoors. So that's screen number one. But the two other types of screens that we are using at this campground are pretty neat. One of them goes on the side doors. And Jennifer, you want to go show them that one? Okay, this is something that I'm very excited about. This is an aftermarket product. We've seen people that have made their own. There's several different brands out there. It works with magnets. Open up, shuts up. There are open spaces, but we've used it, and so far we've been fortunate. We have no CMs here in Florida, and we haven't been bothered. We've used this two nights with this open. You can take it down, you can leave it up. It fits quite snugly, but like I say, there are, you know, there are a few open spots. But so far, no problem. And you can leave it up and shut the door. And there's a third type of screen that we use. That's these guys. They fit over the uh, driver and passenger side doors. And they too work with magnets. You can see here there's some, some magnets that are, that are uh, sewn right into the mesh fabric. You just slap them right on like that. These are the Skeeter Beaters. You can find these at the Road Trekking Store. Dot com and this is really nice because we put one on the driver's side and one on the passenger side and you get really nice air flow through there and when you're using your uh, roof fan the fantastic fan in the uh, road trek rv at least it sucks in that cold air and it pulls out the uh, uh, pulls out the warm air it makes it really really nice so we love these things they come in different colors different styles this one is uh, set for the sprinter model class b rv they also have some that work on the chevy chassis as well skeeter beaters you can find them at roadtrekkingstore.com. They're 49 bucks for a set of two. So that's how we solve our bug problem with these three different options. If you have anything you want to share, something you've created, we'd love to hear from you. Just use the email address right below and you can email us your questions and we'll answer them in the next edition of How We Roll. Till then, road trekking across North America, we're Mike and Jennifer Wendland. Thanks for watching.